Oh, what? I can't jump on the heads? Oh. Oh, no. Oh. <laughs> What's up, guys? Hope you've been well. Today, we're, I'm playing Cuphead, um, a game I downloaded from the Xbox store. But it is available on PlayStation, PC, Switch, all the platforms pretty much. And um, I saw some reviews on it and it's got really high reviews. And um, what what I liked about it, the, the appeal of it, is it's very retro style artwork. Kind of reminds me of Tom and Jerry, like the old retro Tom and Jerry. Um, but come hang out guys and let's play some Cuphead new game oh by the way guys um if you want to add me as a friend on xbox my user tag is roman's life like my youtube channel obviously give me an ad so let's see please select player red or blue let's go with red what's up cat Once upon a time, in a magical place called Inkwell Isle, there were two brothers named Cuphead and Mugman. They lived without care under the watchful eye of the wise Elder Kettle. One day the two boys wandered far from home and despite the Elder Kettle's many warnings, ended up on the wrong side of the tracks and entered the Devil's Casino. Inside Cuphead and Mugman soon found themselves on a winning streak at the craps table. Hot dog, explained King Dice, the casino sleazy manager. These fellas can't lose. He's hustling, he's hustling. Nice run, boys, laughed a newcomer. The brothers gasped. It was a casino owner, the devil himself. Now how about we raise the stakes, he suggested with a toothy grin. Win one more roll and all the loot in my casino is yours. The devil boomed, but if you lose, I'll have your souls, deal. Cuphead, blind, blinded by the easy riches, nodded and grabbed the dice for a throw. Good gosh, Cuphead, no, cries Mugman, for he understood the danger, but it was too late. Snake eyes, laughed the devil while slamming the floor. You lose. The brothers trembled in fear as he loomed over them. Now how about these souls? The brothers pleaded for their very lives. That th there must be another way to repay you, Mugman stampered, stampered. Yes, please, Meister, Cuphead added. Hmm, perhaps there is a, there is, the devil sneaked, snickered, pulling out a parchment. I have here a list of my runaway debtors. Collect their souls for me and I might pardon you two mugs. Cool pun. Now, now get going, the devil roared, kicking the boys out most rudely. You have till midnight tomorrow to collect every one of those souls, otherwise I'll be the one collecting yours. Carphead and Mugman were terribly frightened and ran away as fast as they could. Come on, Mug, panted Cuphead. We have to find Elder Kettle. He'll know what to do. Pretty cool. I love the art style of it. Reminds me of... Um, like retro Mickey, how Mickey used to look back in the days. And Cup, Cuphead's um, pants look like Mickey's and his gloves are like Mickey's as well. Pretty pretty cool. What a fine pickle you boys have gotten yourselves into. I know you don't want to be, the, be pawns of the devil, but if you refuse, I can't bear to imagine your fates. You must play along for now, collect those contracts, and you'd best be ready for some nasty business. Your dear friends won't be very friendly once you confront them. In fact, I expect you, they'll transform, transform into a terrible beast. Take this potion so they won't hang you out to dry. I'll give you the most remarkable magical ability. Now go to my writing desk and use a mystical inkwell there. Sorry, my cat. He wants to be pizza. You need to prepare yourself for a scrap. 
Oh yeah, cool. You can move around. Let's use the tutorial, see what... The tutorial. Hold down to crouch. Oh yeah. Jump. Tap for a short hold for high jump. Quick evade on the ground on air. Oh yeah. Parry slat. Press jump while airborne to nullify or interact with pink objects. This also builds your super meter. Okay. Resurrect. Revive your dead pal with a well time parry on the ghost two player mode only. X move. An upgraded attack that will require one super meter card to fill up. Ah, oh, yeah. It's like a. Kamehameha or Hadouken. Coin. Collect coins to purchase items from the shop. Hey fellas, looks like you're in, in for it now, eh? Well, I used to be the same way, always. Getting into trouble. Running, jumping, shooting. But now I prefer just, to, just strolling around and going to the pictures. But hey, let me give you a hand, take this. You receive three gold coins, yeah boy. Ah, there's a shop there. Maybe I can use my gold coins. Pork Rhine's Emporium. What do you have? Chaser. Long range with below average damage, no aiming required. Heart, extra hit point, adds an additional hit point but lightly weakens your attack power. Spread, short range with great damage if you can keep close to your targets. Smoke bomb, invisible dash. You will not take damage during a dash, a great defenseman you were. Jump rebound, great coverage with average damage, aim backwards for maximum damage. Look, I'm going to go with heart because you never know. I'll probably, being a noob in this game, I'll probably die many times. So the more life, the merrier, I guess. Goodbye. You've got to equip those purchases if you want to use them. Look at your equip card, you bums. Why? To bring up the menu. Heart. Extra hit points. Add additional hit points but lighten, lightly weakens your attack power. What's up buddy? It's my cat. He's meowing. I think he wants to go outside. I love the art style guys. Honestly it's so cool. What's this? Run and gun, forest follies. Should we, I guess this is a level? Kind of reminds me of Mario World where you got the world map and you can just go into different, different stages. Should we have a jam on that guys? I let my cat out first, he's being a pain. All right guys, I let my cat go outside and let's get back into the game. Forest follies. All right. Oh. <laughs> oh, I suck. Oh, what? I can't jump on their heads? Oh.
this is the first level. Oh, what? And they keep respawning as well, so. Gold coin, like Super Mario. It kind of reminds me of like, oh, ho, ho, ho. I honestly thought this game would be like soup, like for kids, but it's not easy. Oh, what? <laughs> this is the first stage only, guys. All right. Oh. So, there we go. Difficulty, simple or regular? Let's go regular. Because I'm not simple. I'm regular. Oh! Oh no! All right. We can do this. Oh yeah, that's my new weapon. Long range is so much more better though. Oh man, come on. It's an onion. What am I supposed to do? Just avoid his tears? Oh, really? You're joking. Oh, what? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh. <laughs> oh man. This is definitely not a kid's game. Maybe the s simple mode. That'd be all right. All right. Honestly, what I've realized about this game is it's about pattern, like all enemies have patterns and it's just about learning the patterns. And I think, to be fair, dying in this game is probably not a bad thing because at least you're learning their patterns. Oh! It's really weird. I, I,
I'm lean, mean, and full of beta carotene. <sighs> Guys, thanks for hanging out. Thanks for watching me play Cuphead. And um, it's been an interesting experience. I really love this game. I think it's, you know, if you don't want to think, you just want to just pick up the controller and just have a jam. This game's awesome. It does have its challenges because I've died probably 20 times and it's I'm up to the second level. And but it's fun. I love the art style. Like I said, guys, it's retro. I love I love how everything's sort of laid out in the game. And um, all right, guys, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Um, I also have an Instagram account. Follow me on Instagram and comment below. Have you played this game or will you download this game? I think I think it's worth it. I paid. I think it was around thirty dollars on the Xbox Store, and it may vary, or most likely vary in different different platforms like PlayStation, Switch. I'm not sure what the costs are, but it's definitely a cool game. You guys should pick it up. All right, guys. We'll catch you next time.